Good morning. It's time for another episode of It's Not About You. We've been walking through the Bible, looking at different texts and applying it to us, uh, talking about the selflessness of Jesus Christ. As Christians, we're supposed to be selfless like Jesus was. And I know that's a really hard thing, especially in our culture and in the, in, in, uh, the society that we live in. But even our salvation is not about us. It's about God bringing glory to himself through us. And we have to remember that. I want to read just a short little verse from Romans, Romans 12, 2. It says there, Do not be conformed to this world, but be transformed by the renewal of your mind, that by testing you may discern what is the will of God, what is good and acceptable and perfect. <clears throat> We are commanded here not to be conformed to this world. Uh, the, the word used in the, in the New Testament is ecclesia. We're supposed to be the church, the called out ones. And it, that literally means uh, we live in this world, but we don't act like this world. And it's not only that. I think that term ecclesia also applies to the end times. We're gonna be called out of this place. Um, I've got a friend that's struggling with cancer and he came to our pastor's prayer meeting and he was, he said that he has a new laser like focus because he knows he's terminal. He, his focus, he's not going to let anything distract him from the number one thing that God's called him to do. And that's sharing the gospel. And I would tell you that it shouldn't take a crisis like that in our lives to realize what God has called us to do, what our mission is. And our mission is not about serving ourselves. It's not about furthering our agenda. It's about furthering God's agenda. It's about sharing the truth of Jesus Christ with people. And we have to become more and more selfless to do that. We have to get to the point where I don't care if I offend you as long as I'm speaking truth. The truth is offensive to people. When we start telling them they're sinners, we're all sinners, we all have problems, but we can all be saved through the works of Jesus Christ. It is finished, he said. So there's nothing more that we have to do to receive salvation. But once we receive salvation, God wants us on mission with him. He wants us engaging in our world today, sharing the gospel with other people. So I, I just encourage you, remember, it's not about you. It's about God bringing glory to himself through you. Uh, and that takes some sacrifice. So for it's not about you, I want to thank you for taking your time to watch today.